show that one. Yeah, so I mean, what the, so what do you got going on here? What's the background story? Uh, yeah, background, man. Let's try to make this a quick one. My brother Bud, 15 years in the woods, never ran, grew trees around it, grabbed that bitch, brought it to Daytona Beach, making it a street rod. Speaking of Bud, you doing all right? You alive? Yeah, you alive? So I had my brothers come down here, man, try to get this beast on the street here. Hopefully, I don't know. But. We are currently hooking up the front part of the brake system. Uh, the brakes actually ran in on the front. But we're about to, we gotta run some lines and finish the lines in the back for the back brake. But we're moving along. Fucking man, all these parts are on. Damn, dude. We might actually be able to do the doors and shit. <laughs> <laughs> um, what, what issues you been having so far? Well, oh, you've been under the truck. Yeah, I've been under the truck most of the time. I've been having the meat sweats. Yeah. <laughs> uh, one of the problems we had was that the torque converter was jammed up against the engine, so it didn't have to get under there and, and with the starter and arc it and turn the motor because we couldn't do it from the front. Right. And we were, you know, we were tightening that hold up, and we didn't want to hurt the crankshaft. So. And if y'all ain't seen the, the part with the arcs and sparks, here it is. Almost burned we my red. Yeah, got that. We <laughs> unjammed it. So once we unjammed it, we were able to get the torque converter hooked up. Hooked up, but we uh, are missing a couple bolts, which we're going to get tomorrow. We're not. Three bolts go in a torque converter, but this five, fucker wants to put five in. Five bolts. But hey, you know when I'm doing burnouts, I'm building big wide tires on the back. Shut the fuck up. Doing burnouts, I think five bolts would be better than three. Right. Yeah. So that way, when I'm doing my burnouts, man, rip the shit out of that torque. Yeah, three, yeah. Fucking, with three bolts doing burnouts, probably gonna fucking fuck his hair up. But anyways, we did we did a lot, man, in a couple hours more than I anticipated. There's two drive shafts. We got one on. We have. We started the second one, but we're, we got a problem with the yokes and, and bolts, so we got to adjust that out for tomorrow and get that on. Apparently, he had all the parts, but mm -hmm. now when we get here, we're like, hey, man, we need this bolt for this. Oh, fuck, well, let me go and find yeah. it. And you ain't a mechanic if you lost all your <laughs> shit. Yeah, I got bolts everywhere in this house. But, um, <laughs> yeah, it looks like we got a lot together. I mean, guys got the water up on, the alternator, the brake boosters on, the radiators in. Moving right along, man. Just about three hours, since, I think. Since 7.40. 7.40? So, yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, man. Cool. I'm happy. I'm, I'm stoked, man. This is going to be a memory. It'll be in me for, my, for the rest of my life, man. Having my two brothers down here with me right now. So, tomorrow's another venture, but we are going to go out to the Turkey Rod Run here in Daytona, which is a classic two-year event. Comes twice a year, I guess. Get it by the uh, gas pedal. No, I got a gas pedal around here somewhere. I just gotta find it. <laughs> I do have that shit. But, uh, you know, I'm just gonna go look at some nice hot rods, man. Get the fucking shit up under ass. We'll and probably and inspire us to do some more crap. And we'll probably run out of pork by Sunday. That's my goal. My plan is to do that and then, then get some. I wanna hear this thing run. You yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna let here run for it, man. We're gonna try that. Yeah. We'll try that. I, I, I ain't gonna promise anybody that, but. <laughs> I got five gallons of fuel, so we can get, we can get something going. Even if we just got to pour it in the carburetor and pop it. We got to get the ignition and shit hooked up, man. That's, that's a whole other piece. It's a carburetor engine. I got to wire to the starter and everything, man. It's another freaking issue. I got <laughs> to find those parts, too. Oh, fuck. I got the meat sweats, man. I'm out of here. Because <laughs> life's different when you're living at the mud park. Take me to my bar. Listen to my VA train